Here we are, first video. Uh, Marley's back. He's one of our little uh, testers here. And today we're going to be testing Dean of the Dead hot sauce. So we have three of his sauces here. And we're going to test them in a sort of heat order. So oh, this one is called Texas Chainsaw Massacre. I mean, it's, these are named after movie, horror movies. He's a great uh, horror movie fan. Second one is called the Naga Mare on Elm Street. I mean, another great one. And then we have the Exorcist. So, great labels, great fun. Are you up for it? Yeah. Right, we've got some spoons here. So, we've got a spoon each, and we've got something to eat it off. So, let's start it all off. So, you want to grab a spoon? You choose your weapon, and uh, we'll read the ingredients. So, we have. Uh, uh, you can read it, you probably have better eyesight than me. So we got chipotle, cherries, habanero, peppers, scallions, cherry juice, garlic, onion, powder. Onion powder, yeah. yeah. Uh, wow, it's gone a bit with them. Uh, smoked uh, pap paprika. paprika, brown sugar, lemon juice, salt, black pepper. Balsamic vinegar. Balsamic vinegar. Yeah. Right. Yeah. So, um, I'm, I'm, I'll say I'm a sauce maker myself, and I have a lot of sauces. So I thought I might as well give some of my love back and help these guys out. We have a, a, a very low rating of two, and we have a lovely look at that beautiful aiming. And then, blah, and we have a beautiful look picture of Dawn. You know, well, I think that's uh, it's like Dean with a beard. So, uh, right, so figure out how to open these up. We'll have it smell first, yeah, before we yeah. gollop it down, because I know you're in a hurry. If you hear any noises in the background, it's the wife. She's in there cooking the dinner. So, give it a good shake. Ripping, ripping the company. <laughs> and, uh, and this is a vegan sauce, by the way. So, there's a uh, vegan. Ooh. Right, do you want to get your spoon out? Come on, we'll give it a taste. <laughs> smells really good actually. It smells proper smoky. <gasps> Try not to get on the carpet, mm -hmm. Marley. Go forward. Don't eat it yet. Oh, it smells like that. Oh, so, it smells very well. It smells like garlic. I'm not a great knowing of the smell, so I suppose as I go through these things, I'll learn. So, do you want to have a taste and see what you think of it. I've got another two of these to go through yet, so. That's quite sweet. Mm. Mm. I can taste the garlic. Delicious. It yeah, it's really good. It's really good. That is, that is really nice. And it's low in one. Yeah. So you get a nice burn around the throat here. Nothing else, and I'm getting a bit warm from my chest. I didn't, didn't say what chilies were in it, what did it say? Oh, habaneros. Yeah. About there, like. Well, it's really nice. Yeah, that's really good for flavour. So, have a chip. Let's put some on the chips. Always yeah. like Because I always have, well, I have a bigger chip than that. Yeah. We can pour your own on if you want. Right, so. It's like sweet flavour again. Mm. It's like sweet in the crisps that it has. Mm. I know Dean has tried my sauces. He basically used a whole lot on his kebab, so I mean, I, he's a very, very, very brave man. It's not the sort of thing I bought a whole bottle on. I enjoy, I actually enjoy these. So, what do you reckon about that? Flavour, really, really nice. Uh, it's not too hot, so I definitely. I mean, it's got a kick to it. Yeah, I definitely think it's good for people who aren't massively into the heat, but also like a bit of spice. Too. I mean, I think if, if I gave some of that to Tracer, I'm sure she'd probably go, ah, it's too hot. But you never know. I'll have to invite her in and uh, see if she wants to try some. But yeah, it, it has got heat. I can taste it on my tongue. It feels like a, someone sort of like set a small flame on it, but it's manageable for me. Manageable for you. 
Mm. <laughs> right, so, so you're up for the Naga next? Yeah. Mm. So, we're going for the Naga, and another, I might say, another great vegan sauce. So, I love the fact that uh, it's all, all vegan, so I, you know, I can eat it. Anyway, because I'm not vegan, but uh, yeah, Tracy could have it if she wants to put it in some of her uh, sauces because she, she keeps asking me for these. Well, not these particular ones, but sauces to go with food. So here we have the Naga. Do you want to read the ingredients on that one, Molly? Yeah. All right, so we've got Naga chilies, habanero peppers, peach, mango, pineapple, scallions, mango juice, jerk seasoning onion powder, brown sugar, lemon juice, salt, ground white pepper, apple cider vinegar. So it's going to be another sweet one I think. Yeah. Quite a fruity one. Do you want to pour it on yours? You can do your own spoon. I'm not telling you how much you can have. Look at that check. <laughs> T-shirt, look at that. Oh, blueberry scorpion. Oh, do we shake this one? Yeah, yeah, it's fine. Just carry on. I don't think uh, they're not separated so there's no um, separation on these sauces. Oh, so you're going a full spoon there. Yeah. Mm, that, this one smells spicier than <gasps> the other one. So that was still there. No worries. So, I smell, yeah, I can smell the. You can smell mango in this one. Obviously, because mango's in it. Mmm, smells very good. It's not, um, not as sweet as the last one, but I'm. Um, well, do you want to try it? I'll be in trouble eating a spoonful like this, but mm. oh, that's rude! You can taste the mango. Taste the peaches, mango. It's really fruity. I can taste the side of it coming coming through now. The heat. It's quite. It's a bit. There's not too much heat for me, but you can taste it. It's mm. one of those probably ones that come through after you've had it. Mmm. That's really good. No, I like I like the sweet ones. Uh, so Dean does. He's got his own band, and he's into horror. So he is like into his horror games. And he does um, um, does online stuff on uh, Demon of the Dead with um, uh, Spotify and other sort of things. So you can listen to them. So you can listen to his and so I think uh, Nightmare and Elstree. I think he actually even. Uh, had a bottle given to Robert Umbland. Well, on his website it looks like it. Pretty crazy, by the way. <laughs> They're really good sauces. What would you have it with? Um. I mean, would you have it on a pizza or? I don't care. I'm picking up my mess here. Um, <laughs> really strike the, the heat on this one caught me a bit off guard. Um, it's very free. I mean, the habaneros and the previous one always get you. Yeah, I'll do it. And that, I, the sweetness. I think. I'm getting a bit of a sweat on. I'm not saying it's not hot, believe me. Yeah. Um, I think I don't. I, I wouldn't say it's for a big meaty meal or. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> There's a the heat's coming through. By the way, yeah, we're, we're sort of getting a hot mouth. Mm. Yeah, my bed is alright though. It's just a, this one sticks in the mouth, like the other one was mouth and. Yeah, well, this is a, a, a step up from the other one in heat level. I mean, you can see here we have a, a three chilies. I think they're out of, oh, this one's out of seven, I think. Oh, uh, jeez. <laughs> <Morning. laughs> so this is probably one that you probably, this is the, you know, the exorcist of AC. But I think I'm That, I would say, is, is great with probably in a bolognese. Hardly. I'll have, have it on, in a wrap. Some it's a wrap for this kid. I think for wrap. It's a chicken may uh, marinade, maybe mixing some mayonnaise. It's it's quite fruity, but it is. It's like I'm feeling the heat coming through now. 
really looking forward to. Well, this is only this is only three, so we are coming up to the hiccup stage. The Exorcist, I mean, Exorcist. This is a uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, six. Yeah. <laughs> Do you want to swap spoons? <laughs> <laughs> right, so I'm I'm really impressed with these, Dean. These are brilliant, mate. Flavour wise as well, yeah. yeah. You have uh, really knocked it out of the park. I mean, I'm not saying you have you already know this, but yeah, you know, I like sauces, and I'm never going to give a bad review. I just, but these are really good. I can't even open it. Right there, Marley. Yeah, that second one just stayed in the mouth there. The second one is one chili higher than the first one. The first one <laughs> was really, really sweet. The second one's really sweet. Just like my sauces, they come back and they just carry on. So I suppose it, it's called Dean's Revenge, really, after me giving one of my death skulls and let him do it on my video. So I'm really looking forward to this one. Not <laughs> I feel like this one's smell is going to be a bit different. So we have the exorcist and the ingredients on that one are. Oh, my eyesight's gone. Uh, <laughs> it's gone blind. <laughs> Carolina Reaper. Carolina Reapers. And ghost peppers. So. Mm -hmm. Habaneros, pear, pineapple. Pears and pineapple juice. Granulated sugar. Mm -hmm. Mustard powder, basil, onion, powder, oh, uh, salt, <laughs> apple, <laughs> and cider vinegar. Oh, struggle to so, it's going to be sweet, again, because I think he does a lot of fruit sauces. Sure, it's pineapple. But, the, I mean, he's got more on his range. You can see the heat ranges on there, and we've just had those ones, and now we're up here. So, you're really looking forward to this one? Oh, the heat wise, it's going to be a lot oh, different. You don't have to have so much, you pour yourself, you don't have to pour it, you can put a little bit on. Well, so you don't do continuation. I mean, the heat's still in my mouth from the previous one, yeah. So, so I say a good two to three minutes of, uh, of, of fire. I'm not sure how much you want to put in there, that oh, oh. yeah, that's a good. Uh, don't tip it the other way. <laughs> I think it's not as all that really nice. Right. So just... I'm, I'm not going to be too brave. I'm going to still take. I mean, that's <laughs> a full teaspoon, as we have here. All right. yeah. Good luck, mate. You can smell that pineapple though. It smells for you. It can smell of the reapers. Oh, my eyes are going to be watering soon. <laughs> Love it. Cheers. <laughs> Bottoms up. Let's double your wimps. Let's just do it. Let's do it. Mm. Oh, it's really sweet. <laughs> oh, damn, it's really sweet. <laughs> and all of a sudden, it's like. <coughs> okay, it's not sweet. I haven't had the, the heat come through. I feel like the heat's going to hit. I think the heat is a slow builder. I was going to say, because right now it's, it was like a quick quick spark, and now it's kind of mellowed out. But yeah, sweet, really sweet. I mean, I would say the other one was hotter, but I haven't finished. This one is still going, isn't it? So, yeah. But yeah, considering it's got Carolina Reapers in it, it's the world's hottest chili that we can buy. Well, remiss if uh, obviously there are people out there who make their own hot breeds. But I'm gonna. If I think, I think the problem with sauces is if you get them right in your mouth and you don't choke or you don't cough. I think you survive the, the heat. If the moment you have one bit of a choke, I reckon it just goes, Ugh. and then that's when you're breathing in all this hot, hot breath. I think I put a bit too much on. I think I'm going to regret this. Well, show the camera that you're not, not frightened of it. Of it. So, yeah. Oh, this feels like it's getting a bit warm on the back of the tongue. They're really, I like them, they're delicious. They're like, False sense of security, proper sweet, like um, delicious flavours. I would not, I would eat these. 
probably all the time. I, I wouldn't do Dino's and fill it kebab with it. But. <laughs> yeah, flavour-wise, it's really nice. It's really sweet. Especially as soon as you put it in your mouth. Mm. Oh, I, would, I, would say, I wouldn't say it's as hot as that one. But I think it's warming up, though. I think it's a slow builder, and I think it's one of those things that will get you. But it depends on, you know, I've had that much, and we've only had that much, so there's probably a little bit of difference. <laughs> so, if anybody's interested in buying these, I'm not sure the prices because I didn't really look at the website, I'm a bit uh, premature here. But I'd say they're made in England, as it says on there, they're vegan, and I would say look, look at um, Demon of the Dead and give them a, give them a try there they are also also you'll find them also doing some of the uh, chili festivals <laughs> so he'll be doing the uh, chili festivals um chili and cheese he's doing also uh will be with me s selling in the hot sauce society in london it's coming up in the end of august stephen what are you doing to my grandson again he, he likes hot sauce tracy <laughs> You can what? tell, can't you, that he loves it. He loves hot sauce. No, that was really nice flavour, but Jesus, it's hot. It's like staying in my mouth. It's making me really snotty, actually, now. We need to prepare, don't we? This is our first video, so... Well, we've done videos before, but, you know, to have a, you know, a sock rag there to hop it up. So, look him up. He does a, a music, he does videos, he's doing the horror conventions, he does comic cons. Check him out, he is thumbs up for me. So it's watching. Hopefully you uh, enjoy the show and decide to come back and, and if you don't, go and buy some white sauces too. Bit cheeky, aren't I? <laughs>